Okay, fabulous fourth graders. Uh, we're going to be working on page. What is it? Page 47. Today's date is 0908 2020. Okay? So, what I'd like you to do is try to do these on your own, all of these problems. In, f in fact, you know what? Let's uh, cross out B. The three ones in the middle. So let's go and do these six problems and then start on this one as well, okay? Let's go ahead and pause the tape. And welcome back. Let's just take a look at what we got here, okay? Our first problem is I'm going to write them on another piece of paper so they're nice and big. And you can see if you got them right. Is, um, 2,460 minus 1,370. So, 2,000, whoops, wrong one. 2,460 minus 1,370. Zero, minus zero is zero. We need some help here. That'll become three hundredths. This will become 16 tens. 16 tens minus 7 tens is 9 tens. Look at that. 90. 3 hundredths minus 3 hundredths is 0. And 2 minus 1 or 2 thousandths minus 1 thousand is 1 thousand. And there's your answer to number A or letter A. Let's go to C. 97,684. And we'll be subtracting 49,700. It's always fun when there's zeros. 4 minus 0 is 4, 8 minus 0 is 8. What do we got to do here? We got to take away 1,000 and make it 6. We're going to put 10 hundredths here, so now we have 16 uh, tens, or hundredths. 16 hundredths minus 7 hundredths, 9 hundredths. Can't subtract 9 thousandths from 6 thousandths, so we're going to take 10 thousandths away from this place value. Put that over there, so now it's 16 thousandths. This is 16 thousandths minus 9 thousandths, 7 thousandths, and 8 minus 4, uh, 8. Ten thousandths minus four ten thousandths is four ten thousandths. We'll go to problem D. Two four six zero oh, minus one thousand four hundred seventy two. Okay, I can't take two two ones away from zero ones. Can't be done. Just cannot happen right now. So what we're going to do is we're going to decompose those six tens to five tens. Bring them over here. So now we have ten tens. 10 tens minus 10 ones, excuse me, now we have 10 ones. 10 one, ones minus 2 ones is 8 ones. I can't take 7 tens away from 5 tens, so this is going to become 3 hundredths. I'm going to bring 10 tens over here. So now we have 15 tens. 15 tens minus 7 one, tens. 15 tens minus 7 tens is 8 tens. I can't subtract 4 hundredths from 3 hundredths, so we're going to decompose the thousands. Bring one uh, ten hundredths there to make that thirteen uh, hundredths. So thirteen hundredths minus four hundredths is nine hundredths, and one thousand minus one thousand is zero. You don't need to put a zero there, and you're just left with nine hundred eighty-eight. On F, ninety-seven thousand six hundred eighty-four minus four thousand seven hundred five. What do we get? Well, let's start with our ones. I can't take five away from four. Just can't be done. So we have to decompose the tens, make that seven tens, and bring one of the tens over here. So instead of four ones, it's now 14 ones. 14 ones minus five ones is nine ones. Seven tens minus zero tens is seven. Can't take away uh, seven hundredths from six hundredths, so we need to decompose a thousand and bring ten hundredths over here. So that's now 16 uh, hundredths. 16 hundredths minus seven hundredths is nine hundredths. Six thousands minus four thousands is two thousands, and then just bring down the nine, and we're at ninety-two thousand nine hundred seventy-nine. Two more to go. G is uh, one hundred twenty-four thousand six. Subtract one hundred twenty-three thousand one hundred seventeen. Okay, we've got a lot going on in this problem here. See right away, I can't take seven ones away from six ones. Got zero there, zero there, and finally something we can work with, we can decompose. So I'm going to decompose, start with a thousand. It's going to become three thousand, and this is going to become basically one thousand, or ten tens, right? 
Gonna need a little help there still, and still need help there. So this is gonna become now nine hundredths, and this will become ten tens. Okay, still gotta go. This is gonna become nine tens, and we'll add those uh, ten ones that we gave over here to the six ones, so we have sixteen ones. Woo! Sixteen ones minus seven is nine ones. Nine tens minus one ten is eight. Tens, 900 minus 100 is 8 hundredths, 3,000 minus 3 thousands is 0, 2 10 thousands minus 2 10 thousands is 0, 100,000 minus 100,000 is 0. So we're left with 889. Believe it or not, we added this and this, we would get that. I bet you believe it. We'll try another one. 124,060 less... 31,117. Okay, right away, I can't take seven ones away from zero. So I'm going to decompose the ones, make those five ones, and make this five tens, and make this ten ones. Ten minus seven is three. Five tens minus one ten is four. Stuck. Can't take one hundred away from zero hundred, so we're going to decompose that to three thousands. This will become ten hundredths, or one thousand. Ten hundredths minus one hundred is nine. Three thousands minus one thousand is uh, two thousands, and now we're here. Can't take three ten thousands away from two one thousands, so this is going to become a big old zero. And I'm going to give my um, ten ten thousands to these two ten thousands to make twelve ten thousands. Twelve ten thousands minus three ten thousands is indeed nine ten thousands, and there we have it. So let's do our one word problem of the day. We're not doing the back side of our problem set. So uh, let's do this one word problem. It says, draw a tape diagram to represent each problem. Use numbers to solve after write your uh, answer as a statement and check your answers. Okay, there are 86,400 seconds in one day. If Mr. Legal's class, Mr. Legal is at work for 28,800 seconds a day, how many seconds a day is he away from uh, work? So. Let's make the tape diagram. This is going to represent the day. And there's 86,400 seconds of the day. So Mr. Legal is at work for 28,800 seconds, okay? So we'll put that right around there. 28,800. So to figure out this amount, that he's away from work, and I'm going to put an A to show A, we need to do a subtraction. We need to do subtraction. So, let me find a nice piece of paper here. We're going to subtract 86,400 minus 28,800. All right? So, 86,000. 400 subtract 28,800. 0 minus 0 is 0. 0 minus 0 is 0. Problems. So this is 6,000 is going to become 5,000. And these 400s are going to become 1,400s, right? 14 minus 8 is 6. 1,400s minus 800s is 6. Once again, problem here. I can't take away 8,000s from 5,000s. It just can't be done. So that's going to become 7 ten thousands. I'm giving one of my ten thousands away to this column. So it's 15 thousands. 15 thousands minus 8 thousands is 7. And 7 ten thousands minus 2 ten thousands is 5. So we have 57,600. Let's go ahead and check this one. 57,600 plus 28,800. We should wind up with 86,400. There's 0, 0, 6 plus 8 is 14. Bring the 1. 8 plus 7 is 15 and 16. And 5 plus 2 is 7 and 8. So we do indeed have 86,400. And we'll write a statement. He spends 86,400 seconds. No, he doesn't. <laughs> he spends. 57,600 seconds away from work. There we have it. Okay, go ahead and log on to Zern until uh, 10.30. That'll be recess time.
and we'll see you back here at 1045. Thank you so much.